Invasive king crabs have made their way to British shores, sparking fears that local brown crab and scallop populations could be decimated. Fishermen in the north of the UK found their pots heavy not with brown crab, but with the bright red invader with long, spindly legs prized for their sweet flesh. London restaurants have already snapped up the hall, ready for weekend menus. The fishermen were shocked as these crabs had never been seen off British shores. The species, native to North America, was introduced to Russia in the 1960s by scientists who wanted to establish a new, lucrative fishery. Thriving in cold seas, the crab population exploded, and they traveled to Norway, where they caused a fishing industry boom. And now they seem to have traveled all the way to Britain. Fishermen in the UK are tentatively excited, as many fisheries in Norway became rich off the invasive species, though environmentalists are alarmed about the potential impact on native species. Will Murray, head chef at Fallow Restaurant in St. James Market, London, has bought up some of the Hall of King crabs. He said he planned to cook the crabs over charcoal and make a sauce with the meat from the head. The sauce will be poured over potatoes boulanger and the legs served alongside. He said, we are excited, but a bit terrified, as they really are invaders and could kill off all our brown crabs. This could be the next gray squirrel, the next Japanese knotweed, but at least these are easy to cook and enjoyable to eat. This is some of the best seafood in the world, a real premium ingredient. However, despite their delicious taste, he said the crabs did not bode well for the rest of his menu. The chef said it could be good for British fishermen if we react the right way, and if we can export the commodity, but at the same time it's bittersweet as it ultimately means that native populations are going to suffer. They breed in a layer on the seafloor and can grow to a massive size. The fishermen are already getting bigger pots to fit these bigger crabs in. You can see from reports from the fishermen that the population has just exploded. Back in Norway these monstrous crabs, which now number in the millions, have become the center of a huge industry, in one month, Norway exported nearly $9 million worth of king crab. The price of king crab has tripled in just over a decade, according to the Norwegian Seafood Council. The king crab is now distributed to the world's finest restaurants, hotels and casinos. When researchers in Norway surveyed the fjords of the Varanger region in 2012, they found that the abundance of many seafloor species had dramatically declined since the crab's arrival. In some areas, mussels and starfish had disappeared completely. Such changes ripple up the food chain, other native species, such as haddock, depend on these seafloor species for food. Britain could now find similar problems in their water. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel, and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on 15 fun facts about dolphins. Thanks for watching and bye for now.